you today in the fight to make Hillary Clinton and Tom Kane the next president and vice president of the United States of America. Of president. 
And Tim Kaine, her running mate and vice presidential candidate, has demonstrated his leadership while serving, most importantly, as mayor of the city of Richmond, Virginia, ah! as well as governor and senator for the great state of Virginia. He is also a dedicated husband and father. Yeah. So give it up, Gainesville, and welcome the man you Sometimes 
know, in Florida, wait, are you guys just toying with this? Because it seems like every presidential election, you start with 50 states, and that's how you start. And then, you know, some are really red and some are really blue, then you whittle it down to maybe 12 or 13 states that are battleground states, and then you whittle it down even further within the battleground states. Virginia's a battleground. My, my home state of Virginia, I see a Virginia Tech shirt over here somewhere. Yeah. Oh, um, you whittle it down, you whittle it down, you whittle it down, and you even get to fewer states that are what I call the checkmate states. The checkmate state is a state that the other side, if they don't win it, they can't find a path to the White House. Florida is one of those states. Pennsylvania is one of those states. North Carolina, Ohio, there's probably four this cycle that are just absolute checkmate states. And the reason that that's important, and then I want to talk about a couple of issues, but just to put it this way, if you live in a checkmate state, you know, you don't have to wait up until Central Time or Mountain Time or Pacific Time to know who the President of the United States is. You, you can just do the work you need to do right here. And if you can produce that win for Hillary right here, you can pretty much take it to the bank that she's going to be president. So, Shoulders, right? When you are key to it, that means you got to do your best work. So let's start with the debate. What an Hillary fantastic and most beautiful. Oh, yeah. She, was, oh, yeah. she was so fantastic in these three debates. Um, you know, it was, yeah, you know, I did all right. <laughs> I had a good time. I, was, I had kind of a feisty debate, but that's. You know, nothing, nothing wrong with feisty. It's like, yeah. it's like around the kitchen table at my house. Um, Passion. But Hillary was so good. There were so many great moments in those debates. Um, one of my favorite moments was in her first debate at the end when Donald Trump got confronted with something negative he'd said about Hillary. I think it was, what did you mean when you said she doesn't look very presidential, does she, fellas? And he tried to say, well, I wouldn't. Oh, and Lester Holt said, was that about her gender? Was that about her looks? And he said, no, 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 I was talking about her stamina. But well, then Hillary, she had a great answer. So there's a split screen. You can see them both in split screen. And Hillary says, well, you go to 120 countries, and you testify before Congress for 11 hours, then you can talk to me about stamina. 